Okay, this video is to explain the center worksheets for the week. On Monday, you'll be doing Write the Room for the Igward Family Words. So the cards are here. You can hide them around the room or hang them up around the room and then um, write the word in the matching number space. For this one, you're gonna be doing um, addition. So there's a big number in the middle of the flower is a four. If the petal equals four when you add it, then it will, um, then you color it. So four plus zero, that equals four, so you'll color here. Two plus two also equals four. If you're having a hard time with like adding, you can use objects or you can use your fingers, okay? So then this one you'll do seven, five, and six. So those are Monday's worksheets. Tuesday, you're gonna do um, the March Madness and Middles. So each of these words is missing the middle letter. So you're going to put the letter in here where it goes. Um, like for example, cut, k, a, t, a, a, okay? So you're gonna do that for that one. And then you're just gonna focus on the number 20. That one should be pretty easy. You're just writing the number 20, coloring 20 hearts, and then circling 20s on the bottom. This one for Wednesday, you're going to be reading the sentence and then there's a picture to match the sentence. So, for example, this one says, my mom can mop. So read the sentence and then cut the picture out and glue it on where it belongs over here. Uh, this one's called adding shamrocks. You'll cut out all the shamrocks and then it says glue the correct number of shamrocks in the space to solve the problem. So this is four plus two. So you're gonna glue four of these up here, four, and then two more, and then add them all together and see what you get. And then for Thursday, you're gonna be doing butterfly beginning sounds. So you'll use this. Then this is just a little extra helper thing. Um, like resource, you'll use this row right here, okay? We're not using this, just using this. So you'll look at the picture, it says bow. Does bow start with a B or a D? B, B, bow. Then you're gonna write bow underneath um, the B. If you don't know how to spell bow, you come over here and you look for the picture and then there's the word, okay? So that's that one. <clears throat> then the last one for math, is um, called coloring lucky gold. So this is the number 11. Each one of these pots has 10 coins. So if we um, color this one, how many more coins do we need to add to make it 11? One more, right? So 10 and then this one makes it 11. Let's do one more together, 14. So 10. We don't need two pots, that's too many coins. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, oh, I forgot, over here, then you write it. 11, 14. Okay, those are centers for the week. Do your best, talk to you soon.